We're here for a week at Creighton University. It's really a joy to be here and to share in some uh, interfaith dialogue and uh, some of the Tibetan culture. In that room, on a four-foot table, the monks will be creating a sand mandala. Just using these metal funnels called chalk pours, these monks are going to pour grains of sand out and have an elaborate four-foot painting that would represent the celestial home of the Buddha Tara. And within our tradition, it's a way to bring and receive blessings. But on an academic level, it's one way to share an ancient culture. So this beautiful work of art will manifest here over four days. The monks will set their intention and focus. It'll be a wonderful example of art in an ephemeral form. After four days of manifesting this beautiful sand painting, it gets swept up. The rest of the sand will be placed in the river so that it goes into the water and then goes out to the whole of the area, blessing the whole environment. So this mandala serves a higher purpose. The other lesson is, of course, impermanence, because this will look different pretty soon. It reminds us that nothing is forever. Nothing is permanent. This day is never coming again. And it reminds us to live each day mindfully and to make good use of the days and the time that we have to live a meaningful life.